This is a presentation about auditing the commercialconstructionrenovation.com website, ccr-mag.com. Accountability Information Management, or AIM, is a B2B marketing research company that provides publishers like Commercial Construction Renovation, CCR, digital tools to help their advertisers and partners better understand their audiences. This audit is really a lead management tool. It will help marketers find valuable information about ccr-mag.com, its visitors, all of which will help you judge the value of the website itself. And this report will be available monthly through the publisher, David Corson. For more details, just drop David a note. Here's his email, davidc at ccrmag.com. The audit of the website itself is divided into three parts. The Google Analytics information on page one with the publisher's statement. The results of the proprietary code placed on the website by AIM starting on page two. And then page three and subsequent pages, the names of the companies who have actually visited the website for the audited period. We're going to go over each of these sections. On page one, you'll find the audit period in the upper right-hand corner. In this case, late August, 2020. You'll also find information on Google Analytics. The publisher has opened up Google Analytics to AIM in order to audit the website's visitors. Page two, however, is really where the information that's going to be invaluable to your marketing resides. AIM, with the publisher's permission, has placed the reverse IP lookup code on the pages of the entire website. This code allows us to see companies that visit, document their visits, and examine the pages that they consume and then report back to the publisher through this report. In sharing the report with you, the publisher is being transparent, much more so than many other media outlets who report only numbers. So in this report, you will be able to view who's visiting the website, not only as targets for your own marketing campaign, but as validation for your own work with CCR. For example, on page two, you're going to see the number of companies who visited the website during the audited period. You'll also see the number of times that they visited the website, the pages that they viewed, the search terms that they used, and the industries to which they belong. Ames research has demonstrated not only how these people consume data on the internet, but through our investigations, why? In B2B Never Sleeps, Jim Nowakowski, the president of AIM, wrote an article that appeared in the iMark Group's Spring Edition cover story. And you may be interested in reading about it to support your own understanding of the code. On page two of the audit, you'll also find a breakdown of the countries that these companies came from. You'll find the first pages that they viewed. And this is amazing information for the marketer to utilize in shaping messages. But one of the real benefits of this report begins on page three, and it runs for the next eight pages. These are the company names of the who visited the site during the audited period. They give you a firsthand look at who's coming to ccr-mag.com and seeing the messages that you've placed on their website. The first part, companies who came, are slotted into industries. But the majority of companies are not allocated to a specific industry or market, not only because the companies are in more than one market. The reverse IP lookup code, that job of the code, is to identify the company and not do overlays on what market that that company plays in. That's the marketer's job. Therefore, following this, page three, are the subsequent pages in alphabetical order of all the companies that visited ccr-mag.com in the audited month, in this case, late August, 2020. All of these companies, including architects like AECOM, 
consulting companies like Booz Allen, municipalities, home builder associations, and home builders themselves, real estate developers, universities, the list goes on. The website audit, as we mentioned, is a lead management tool to help you understand the nature of the visitors coming to ccr-mag.com. And if you'd like more information, simply contact David Corson, the publisher, at the email provided. In fact, if you'd like more information on the methodology used by AIM for this audit, here's our contact, contact information. Thanks for listening.